is a fun one. Today we're going to make a carrot, tiki, or totem head. It's very useful and often misjudged piece of a salad. You need to know how to make one if you're going to have maybe a Hawaiian themed carrot salad or other salad or food because these will add character. So how do you make a tiki or totem? You get a carrot. I'm slicing down the head. I'm leaving the skin on the side for a rustic effect. And I've got this metal straw, which I pulled out of a wine spout thing. Well, it's a metal straw. I stuck it in there and cut around it to make the eyes. The bulging things are eyes. And there's some eyebrows. Just watch how easy it is. Try to shape out the nose there. Just look at your face and do it. Actually, this one looks like my husband. And he even recognized himself when he saw it. So that's how easy it is to make a carving. And this is really, really great. And another thing you should know is maybe you should um, cook it a little bit or boil it really quickly to keep it from going dry and curling up or keep it in plastic as well, because you want it to last long enough to go into the salad. These little dents on the side are to indicate ear positions. Yeah, it's great, isn't it? Looks just like him, especially after he's had a haircut. This is to make the extra emphatic eyebrow look that he often has, my husband. And, yes, he does have a chin line still, so let's put it in there. Okay, what do you want to do next? Hmm, yeah, let's give him a sweater type zigzag across the chest. Good job, looking good. I mean, just because he always wears a v-neck sweater, I'm giving him several v's in this because I can. You see that, that to make all these lines, I usually cut straight down and then at an angle to the straight cut. Straight down, angle. Straight down, angle. Redo that one again. Ooh, looking great, isn't it? Oh yeah. Now let's do something for the head. Yeah, you can lose a bit of that. Gonna make you pretty now. This is a basic wood carving niche here. A V with an inserted V. Both of the first ones are into the center of the V, and the other ones are from the top going outside of the V. If you ever look at the chip carving, which I have some, uh, you can see how to do this quite easily. Oh, looking like, like my husband more and more. Okay, going for more of a 3D effect here. Cut down and then at an angle in each of these bits coming out of the mouth. Yep, good, doing good. Almost finished, isn't it? Woohoo! You can do this all day long. You can also add nostrils if you feel adventurous. This is a traditional zigzag sawtooth that livens up the top of the head and helps his brain to breathe. Okay. Oh, doesn't he look like a happy tiki? Yeah, it'll look great on a salad too. So I know you love this, so please click to watch another video or to subscribe. Thank you.